A man of many talents once decided to call Las Cruces his home, and now his contributions still echo through the halls of New Mexico State University. KTSM 9 News reporter Cesar Vasquez is live in the newsroom with how the community is celebrating Mark Meadows' life. It only made sense that the legacy of the beloved playwright was remembered in a theater named after him and his wife. The stories shared all expressing Mark Meadows' hope and humor. Nearly every seat filled in the Mark and Stephanie Medoff Theater, the ceremony coming after Medoff's recent loss to cancer. You'd better let somebody love you before it's too late. Thankfully, the somebody he let love him was me. His works resembling the kind of changes he wanted to see. It was actually really like a black hole that he kind of filled um, with, um, you know, just creating deaf theater, helping to create deaf theater and... and um, almost create a genre that, that aided an entire group of people that didn't have that before. Regardless of how he was known, those who crossed paths with Medoff say he always left a lasting impression. You didn't ever have a conversation with him without laughing some, uh, without, without smiling and, um, you know, you learned, you smiled, you laughed, um, you just felt the goodness. Among many accomplishments, his commitment to the crimson and white making him a New Mexican legend. The way in which he's mentoring so many individuals, young and old, in this community to follow their passion and their art. And this was a, a service that talked about hope and enthusiasm. And his legacy now carried on by the lessons he left behind. Thank you for being here. And Mark loves you all, too. As part of the ceremony, Governor Lujan Gresham announced a proclamation making May 19th as Mark Medoff Day. Live in the newsroom, Cesar Vasquez, KTSM 9 News. All right, Cesar, thank you.